so in previous video we saw how to add same card multiple times and this is a problem so in this video we are going to find a optimum solution so if you are facing any other issue like if you are also having any question like Alex so please let me know you can go in disc discussion side or you can comment me down so I will also go through and I will also find a optimum solution if you are also having a better solution please let me know you can also comment me back so first of all I want to say like in previous video you, we have seen like one user have same card you can see here so what we have to do first of all we have to retype the customer so when we retrieve the customer on that time we can get whole details like back account source this whole details so what here main thing we have to find is all the cards so what we can do so first of all we have to just go and put one breakpoint and then go to the debug mode and just click on the app and here after running you can see here we got the customer all the customer details so what we have to do just go and click on the inspect so when you click on the inspect you have to just go down and go to the source so what will happen this source will always contain all the card details of that user so how many cards he having it will always concern here so you can see here he having fingerprint okay same thing other card also having the fingerprint down if you go so from these things like uh, we can get all the fingerprints of all the cards what he ha having after that we are going to add a card so after adding of card on that time we can check like that fingerprint is existing or not if it is existing then we have to just avoid that card so just let's go and we are going to add the card and we'll see how to avoid same card adding so we have just saw like we are having all the card details at the source so source means like external account collection so what we have to do here we have to just come okay and uh, here we are adding the card so I'm just going here and I will create external source and it will contain our all the card details then after that we have to find that customer which customer we want so new customer dot get source so we will get all the card details to the here now after that if you come down you can see here we are creating the token so after creating token we are going to add that token with that customer see here here we are getting the token id and then that token ID we are going to add the source so here we have to just implement our logic so what we can do first of all we will go and we will create a boolean like uh, card is not exist okay equal to true then we can go and create a for loop so I'm just uh, using Java 7 if you are very good you can use lambda expression and whatever you want so int i equal to 0 then i is less than all card details dot get data dot size okay so what will happen like all the cards how many that user having card it will come to the here then we are just doing our for loop so we will run here total that loop here we have to check like new card token is here right so that token id like that uh, fingerprint of that card will be it will be existing in his old cards or not so just come down here just use if so first of all we have to extract that card so in that source if you come down here okay 
so customer having source so inside source we are having the card so we have to first of all we have to find our card so i'm just going to create a, a string you can create a string variable i'm just going to give a okay then all card details dot get data dot get index of i then we have to convert into a string because if you see here if you open this new customer and if you go down into the get source it will give you output as like json format so we have to convert into our thing so i'm just used to to json okay then i will create a card object because we need card inside the card we need his fingerprint so what we can do here we have to just go and create card equal to json dot from json and we can give object like a string a and class as a card then card dot class so like if that user like this user having already four card so what will happen this loop will be run four times so this card here we can get object of all the card if you go down here you can see they are having fingerprint also so we just need his fingerprint so just come back and here we can implement our logic if card dot get fingerprint dot equals with token dot get card dot get fingerprint if it is there that means we no need to create a card so just use card card exist equal to false okay and after that if the loop has been over then we are just going to check if card exist is true then we have to implement add our card else we don't need to add the card so i'm just putting a message like card is already exist card already exist and i will go i will copy cut here i will paste here so what i'm doing here first of all i am getting that customer so in that customer we are having all the card details so all the card details has been stored add to the here this parameter get source so in get source i am creating at external account collection after that i am getting is all the get data so it will contain all the card details and i am running the for loop and inside for loop i am just before i created a token that token i am just checking like that token fingerprint is already exist or not so after that if it is there exist then it is making as a false if it is a false that means card is already added else it will go and add that add that card so i'm just going and comment this one and i will just copy this one so we can get notification like like card created just run and you can see here in console so after that you can see it's showing card already exist so just come here and you can see all the card details is here so first of all i'm going to delete all the card so from a start you can easily understand like card how it is adding and how it's doing all the things so just go delete so i'm going to delete all the cards so now i have deleted all the card so that user does not have any card so i'm just going and running from here so you can see here it's showing card created now just come refresh your screen okay 
so here you can see card already created this is the fingerprint now I'm just going and again I am rerunning you can see it showing card already exist so just come refresh here you can see now it is not adding same card at multiple times so if you are having better solution please let me know if you are having any more question please comment and please subscribe my channel i need more subs subscriber so thanks guys for watching this one